here on the highest Utica campus in the JD Boy Gymnasium. Here they see you at the U event, where local high school students can't see whatever they'll be majoring in and here on the Utica campus. High schools such as Raymond, Lanier, Wingfield, Port Gibson, Murrow, and Forest Hill came out to visit. Recruiter Donnie Epton tells me the purpose of this event. After uh, nearly three years where we haven't had an on-campus event to the size that we had today's event, it was time. It was time to get back to the swing of things. Uh, during COVID, we've had so much go on and we just wanted the opportunity to showcase uh, everything good about the Utica campus today. Uh, had the students come out, tour the campus, visit our booths, get to know the people that make the Utica campus. President Stephen Basin tells me how I feel to see high school students visit the campus. Well, you know, it's really a, a very gratifying thing, first of all, because with COVID, we haven't really been able to do a whole lot for the last couple of years. And so this, this uh, event is exciting. Uh, I think it shows a lot of what we have to offer here at Utica. And uh, it's for us, it's a lot of fun just to have a see you at the U event. So uh, I'm just glad we're able to have everybody back on. Dexter Simmons and Jalen Collins tells me what was their favorite part of this event. I like how they did everything, how they had everybody coming out and how they're trying to engage with the crowd and, you know, just trying to make it interactive. I enjoyed this experience very much. It's really giving me a, a new insight on what it's like to come to the HBCU, game the HBCU energy. And my favorite part was, like, the interaction with all the students and their school. If you miss see you at the U, you surely miss the Bulldog Festival. The nearest main reporter for WHUC, New 7.